Hey guys, it's Mindy from MommyMouseClubhouse.com, and today we are going to be in the kitchen making some Disney magic for Halloween. I'll be sharing my pumpkin spice sugar cookie recipe with you, as well as showing you how fun and easy it is to decorate these adorable Disney-themed Halloween cookies. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already, and hit the notifications bell so you'll know when I upload a new video. Let's get started! This pumpkin spice sugar cookie recipe is one of the most popular recipes on my blog, but pumpkin might not be for everyone. If you prefer a classic sugar cookie, I will have my favorite recipe linked in the description down below. Here is a list of ingredients to make the pumpkin cookies. 3 fourths cup of softened butter, 1 cup of sugar, 2 large eggs, 1 half cup of pumpkin puree, 1 teaspoon of vanilla extract, 1 teaspoon of pumpkin spice, one teaspoon of baking powder, one half teaspoon of salt, and three cups of all-purpose flour. To make the cookies, begin by adding the butter and the sugar to the bowl of a stand mixer. Beat them together until they are light and fluffy. Next, add in the eggs, the pumpkin puree, and the vanilla extract and mix everything together. For the dry ingredients, start by measuring the all-purpose flour into a large mixing bowl. Then add in the pumpkin spice, the baking powder, and the salt. Use a whisk to mix everything together. Combine the dry ingredients with the pumpkin mixture in the stand mixer to create the pumpkin sugar cookie dough. The next step is really important. Make sure you refrigerate the dough for at least two hours. Because of the pumpkin puree in the dough, it will be extremely hard to work with if you don't. Sprinkle flour on your work surface and remove the dough from the refrigerator. I like to work with small sections, maybe a quarter of the dough at a time, and keep the rest either in the refrigerator or even the freezer so it will stay cold. Use a rolling pin to roll out the dough about a quarter of an inch thick, and use a Mickey Mouse cookie cutter or a round cookie cutter to cut out your shapes. I found both of these cookie cutters right on Amazon. Transfer the unbaked cookies onto a baking sheet lined with parchment paper, making sure there is an inch or two between each cookie. Bake them at 400 degrees for seven to nine minutes. When they are done, let them rest on the baking sheet for a minute or two, and then transfer them to a cooling rack. Now let's make the decorating icing. The great thing about this icing is that it dries hard so that you can stack the cookies when they are completely dried. Here is a list of ingredients you'll need three cups of powdered sugar, two to four tablespoons of milk, two tablespoons of corn syrup, one teaspoon of vanilla extract, gel food coloring in orange, yellow, green, and black. Place the powdered sugar in a bowl and add two tablespoons of the milk, two tablespoons of corn syrup, and one teaspoon of vanilla extract. Whisk this mixture together until there are no lumps. For the outline icing, you'll want it to be the consistency of toothpaste. The fill icing should be the consistency of corn syrup. I like to color my icing when it is at the toothpaste stage, then thin out part of it with the remaining milk so that my colors will match. It's time to decorate. Here's a list of the tools you'll need to decorate these cookies. Piping bags, couplers, a small round decorating tip, squeeze bottles, and gel food coloring. Let's start with the Mickey Pumpkin Cookies. First, you will outline the Mickey-shaped cookie with the thicker, toothpaste-like orange icing. Next, fill in the outline with the thinner, corn syrup-like orange icing. Third, you will pipe on the eyes, the nose, and the mouth with yellow icing. 
For the face, I like to have the yellow icing consistency somewhere between toothpaste and corn syrup. Fourth, you will pipe on the leaf with green icing and let the cookies dry. For the Jack Skellington cookies, outline the circle with the white icing and fill it in with the thinner icing. Pipe on the eyes, the nose, and the mouth with black icing and allow the cookies to dry completely. I hope that you enjoy making and eating these fun Halloween cookies with your family. Remember to subscribe and check out the description below for links to all of the products used in this video and for extra tips and tricks. I'll also have a link for you to get discount Disneyland and Disney World tickets if a trip to one of these magical parks is in your future. Thanks for watching. See you real soon.